hello friends welcome to my channel once again and in today's video we will be learning how to find and fix the corrupted file of your operating system uh, if there is any file which is a system file and that is corrupted you will experience problems in your computer it may run slow you may get error messages uh, or there will be problems I mean you will come to know that your computer is not performing well so in order to fix issues like this which occurs because of uh, corrupted system files there is a way you can find and fix those files by simply running a scan called system file checker scan and how you can run that scan I will show you in this video in order to run that scan you will have to open command prompt with admin rights now in order to open command prompts if you just need to type in the Cortana search box CMD and right click on command prompt at the top left click on run as administrator you will get a prompt simply click yes and you will get a command prompt with admin rights this is one of the way the second way is simply right click on the taskbar left click on task manager and you will get the task manager window now in the task manager window you need to click on file run new task type cmd and put a check in the box create this task with admin privileges and click ok you can close the task manager now and we have command prompt with admin rights the command to run SFC scan is uh, I mean system file checker scan is SFC space forward slash scan now scan now will not have any space so in this whole command there is only one space that is after SFC then a forward slash and then scan now without any space simply press enter you will get a message that it will take some time and it will take some time in some cases it may take about 30 minutes uh, in some cases a little bit more or less so what we need to do we need to just wait till this scan completes I mean if you want to use the computer for other purpose like you want to browse internet or you want to check your email you can definitely do that but let this scan complete and don't close this window until and unless the scan is getting completed okay we are making progress slowly our scan is 36 percent completed and we will wait till it completes 100 percent so we'll be back after some time okay let's see the status of our scan okay it got completed 100 percent it took a while but it got completed now let's see the result it says the windows resource protection did not find any integrity violation that means there is no uh, corruption in system files in your operating system but if you get a different result like it found the corruption and it was able to fix that then also you don't need to worry but there is one more result it may show you like it found the corruption 
but it was not able to fix it. Now what to do in that case? If you are getting a result like that, so you will have to run one more command that I will show you on the screen. Okay, so that command is dism.exe blank space forward slash online blank space forward slash cleanup dash image blank space forward slash restore health and simply press enter. It will go through a process. So let this process complete. Even this process may take some time. How you will come to know when the process is completed. So always remember in command prompt when a particular task is completed the cursor will blink next to Windows Search System 32. You will always see uh, C colon backslash windows backslash system 32 and the cursor will blink there right now it, it does not have anything uh, before it that means it is running something now it seems this process will take longer than earlier process. Okay, it is moving a little bit faster now. So, we'll minimize it and we will wait. Okay, so let's see the status. Uh, and so the process has completed and we got the message the operation completed successfully so this is the way you can run a scan to fix uh, corrupted windows system files and by just running these two commands you can fix uh, corrupted files in your uh, operating system and as I was telling earlier, in command prompt, whenever there is a process uh, which will be completed, you will see the cursor will blink next to system 32. So we will close it. Either we can close it by clicking the X at the top right corner or we can simply type exit and press enter. Well, that's it in this video. And thank you very much for watching. Uh, please comment if you did not understand anything. Uh, if there is something you want to know, please comment and subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed yet. Well, thank you once again and you have a great day. Bye-bye.